Welcome to the Good Morning Minute of Inspiration Podcast with your host, Coach P, Jim Pusateri. Our podcast goal is to bring a little inspiration to the world each and every morning. Each day we bring you a short inspirational message to kick off your morning and to put you in the positive attitude that is needed to win the day. We discuss a quote of the day and spread some insight in developing the three phases of achievement, passion, goal setting, and mindset. Passion. We help you find your passion in life and your dream job so you never have to work a day in your life. Goal setting. We show you how to establish lifelong goals so you have a written blueprint for your life so you can achieve everything it is that you want in this world. And mindset. The ability to move forward under pressure, the mental toughness to succeed. Hey, I'm Coach P. Jim Pusateri, and I have 30-plus years of experience helping others succeed in business startups, business management, self-improvement, and health and wellness programs. I have developed several companies from the ground up, along with being a business and physical education teacher and a head football coach at the high school level here in Florida. I use all that experience to teach others how to be successful in life. My passion is to educate and inspire people to move forward towards success. Our company, Inspirational University, is here to help you prepare to find your dream job, establish lifelong goals, and develop the mindset to succeed. Let's get to today's free daily podcast. Well, good morning out there, Move Forward Nation of listeners. Coach P here, Jim Pusateri, your host. And I thank you for downloading this episode, number 706, in the second year of this podcast, The Good Morning Minute of Inspiration. Our topic for today, Five Steps to Build Self-Confidence. This will close up our Tips Weeks, which we dedicated all of our podcasts this week to your self-improvement. Be sure to check out all of the podcasts this week. Five Steps to Building Self-Confidence. Well, you can start building self-confidence by getting our free booklet, The Five Ps to Success. Yeah, we show you how to use the five Ps to develop the mental toughness to succeed, the ability to move forward under pressure. You can get this booklet free of charge by hitting the link in the show notes below, or there is a link over on our website, inspiringthem.com. Again, it's the five Ps to success, passion, perception, perspective, progressing, and perseverance. We show you how to use those five Ps to develop that mental toughness, that ability to move forward under pressure. Hit that link in the show notes now for your free copy. Hey, if you would like to ever have something discussed on our show, maybe you got a topic, maybe you got a favorite quote you'd like us to feature, whatever it is, you can reach out to me at coachp at inspiringthem.com. That's coachp at inspiringthem.com. And as always, if you want to further today's discussion when it's over, comment on this podcast, questions about the five steps to building self-confidence, or questions about mastering the three phases of achievement which is passion, goal setting, and mindset, you can post them at our community forum. There's a link in the show notes below. There's also a link on our website. Again, that's inspiringthem.com, inspiringthem.com. If you're a Facebook user, you can always go over to our community there on Facebook and post that same information over there. It's the Move Forward Nation. Search it up on Facebook and be a member today. Further, today's discussion on our community forum platforms. Hey, we're going to take a short break because we want you to hear how you can master the three phases of achievement, passion, goal setting, and mindset. Listen up, and we'll be right back. What are you looking to achieve? Whatever it is, you need to follow the three phases of achievement. Number one, passion. Number two, goal setting. And number three, mindset. Here at Inspirational University, we have created three courses to help you master each area of the three phases of achievement. Number one, passion. The course is called Dream Job, Finding Your Life Passion. This course takes you on a journey in locating your interest and determine what is your passion and how to make it your career so you never work a day in your life. Number two is goal setting, your life blueprint. This is a step-by-step -step course teaching you on how to establish lifelong goals and how to achieve them so you can move from being a dreamer to a successful goal setter. And number three, mindset. 
Developing Your Mental Performance. Do you struggle with self-doubt and confidence? This course will help you gain control over your mind and thoughts so you can develop the mental toughness to achieve. Mental toughness, the ability to move forward under pressure. These three courses are packed full with how-to videos, lessons, and reference sheets, everything you need to master the three phases of achievement. Number one, passion. Number two, goal setting. And number three, mindset. For additional information on each of these courses, hit the link in the show notes below or visit our website at inspiringthem.com, inspiringthem.com. The three phases of achievement. Number one, passion. Number two, goal setting. And number three, mindset. Get your master course today at inspiringthem.com. That's inspiringthem.com. Hey, Coach P here, Jim Pusateri, at Inspirational University, where we prepare you to find your dream job, establish lifelong goals, and develop the mental performance to succeed. Our topic today, Five Steps to Building Self-Confidence. Yes, a lot of people don't have confidence in themselves. They're afraid to step out of their comfort zone. They're afraid to try things new because maybe it didn't happen in the past for them. Maybe they tried it and it didn't work out that well. But most of the time, it's just fear. It's fear of trying. It's fear of failure. It's fear of people laughing at you, you know, peer pressure, whatever it is. You're afraid to step out of your comfort zone. Well, you need to develop these five steps so you can build your self-confidence, so you can create them opportunities for yourself in this world. The first one I'm going to tell you to do is simple. Everyone can do it. Smile. When you smile, you tell others you're happy about who you are and you're open to new relationships. A simple smile can change the world. Yes, it could change the whole world's attitude. Make someone else's day by smiling. It brings out the best in everyone. Remember, folks, a smile brings a positive attitude. And remember, your thoughts are going to control your feelings, and your feelings are going to control your actions. Smile. Control some of them actions. Number two, be positive. People want to hang around and be part of positive individuals. A positive attitude Bring self-confidence and opens up your sphere of influence. Remember, you become just like the five people you spend the most time with. Make sure they're positive people. Because your thoughts are going to control your feelings. And your feelings are going to control your actions. If you're around negative people, that's what you're going to think about. And your actions are going to be negative. Be positive. Number three. Do something that scares you each day. You must have a get better attitude each day. We call it a growth mindset. We talk about it here all the time. It's a move forward. It's the what's next attitude. Don't let nothing derail me. And do something each day that scares you. This will lead to growth, achievement, and self-confidence. Yes, you need to schedule each day one thing that you would like to improve on. But make sure it's difficult. And then go to work on it. Again, it's going to help you grow. It's going to help you achieve. And it's going to build that self-confidence. Remember the three phases of achievement. Passion, goal setting, and mindset. You've got to step out of your comfort zone. You've got to do things that scare you. And you will grow like you never grew before. And that self-confidence will rise each and every time you step out of that comfort zone and you do something good. But see, you got to frame it right because the first time you do it, it may not work out right. And most people quit at that point, and I call them failures. But the ones who continue on and move forward and say what's next and learn from the opportunity, them are goal setters, and they're going to achieve. Number four, embrace self-doubt as a learning experience. There it is. Self-doubt, learn from it. Always think you can learn whatever it is that you're not considered good at. See, folks, you can learn anything. Just take the time, learn one new thing a day. By the end of the year, you'll be an expert. Embrace the negative self-talk and practice to get better. Yes, that self-talk that you've 
you have in your mind that's negative. Reframe it to positive and get better. That's practicing getting better each and every day. Completing that one task we tell you towards your goals each day is getting better each day. There's nothing that you can't be good at as long as you know in your mind with more practice and knowledge I will achieve. Please let me say that again and listen closely. There is nothing that you can't be good at as long as you know in your mind with more practice and knowledge I will achieve. And in other words, don't quit. Gather the knowledge, make yourself better with practice, and achieve. And number five, don't compare yourself to others. Who cares about others? It's you. It's your life. It's your goals. It's your dreams. It doesn't matter what other people think. It doesn't matter what other people say. It only matters what you have in your mind. It doesn't matter what others are good at or what they think of you. It's your perception of yourself that matters and will determine your overall self-confidence. Quit holding yourself back based on what others think. You were designed for greatness and you can achieve whatever you want in this world by changing your mindset. Quit having that I can't attitude and have an I can attitude. Coach P believes in you. I believe in everyone. I know it's in there. You just got to get people to step out of that comfort zone. You got to get people to take that one chance, that risk. You got to get people to understand that practicing and not being good at it is a learning opportunity, is a good thing. It's how you get better. It's not a bad thing. It's not a failure. The only way you fail in this world is you quit. That simple. Don't quit. Those are the five steps to building self-confidence. If you want a copy of that, send me an email at coachp at inspiringthem.com. That's coachp at inspiringthem.com. Again, you want to further today's discussion, there's a link in our show notes below for our community forum. Or if you're a Facebook user, join our group over there. It's called the Move Forward nation. If you're an iTunes subscriber, I'm asking you to please leave us a ranking, a one star to a five star. It helps promote this podcast out to the world. If you're a business owner, I'm asking you to please sponsor the podcast so we can keep it free, so we all together can reach our goal, which is to bring a little inspiration to this world each and every morning. Hey, this is Coach P. Jim Pusateri, and my passion is is to educate and inspire people to move forward towards success. So how can I help you find your passion, your dream job in life? How can I help you establish these lifelong goals so you have a written blueprint for your life, so you can achieve everything it is that you want in this world? And how can I help you develop that mental performance, that mindset, that what's next attitude, that move forward? How can I help you? Reach out to me today. Connect with me on the community forums. Or send me an email, Coach P at inspiringthem.com. It's Coach P at inspiringthem.com. I'm telling you folks, if you learn to master the three phases of achievement, you will succeed. You will achieve. You will have all the self-confidence in the world. Them three phases are passion, goal setting, and mindset. Take our three great courses on them today and master them and watch yourself achieve at levels that you never thought you can. Have yourself a great day now. Let's move forward, and we'll talk again tomorrow. Are you struggling with your fitness workouts? Let our professional trainers here at Showtime Performance Training get you on track. We analyze your fitness level, equipment if any, and other data to build your own personalized workout plan, which is optimized for your sport and fitness goals. It's simple. You can work out at home, at your gym, or one of our locations by downloading our fitness workout app for your phone. Each day, your personalized workout, along with exercises and a video description of each, are loaded into the app so you never have to worry again about your workout plan and schedule. Download the fitness workout app at ShowtimeSAQ.com. That's ShowtimeSAQ.com. Be sure to view our other performance training services, speed, agility, and quickness, SAQ, mental performance, weight loss, and nutritional meal planning. Get all the information at ShowtimeSAQ.com. That's ShowtimeSAQ.com. 
Inspirational University is excited to announce its goal setting course. Yes, goal setting, your life blueprint. It's available now for your purchase. This is a fantastic program to show you how to become successful in this world. Yes, this course takes you from being a dreamer and becoming a goal setter. Because dreamers dream, but goal setters achieve. This course is a step-by-step process on how to write down your goals, break them into action steps, and then into tasks that are scheduled daily to achieve success or whatever it is that you want in this world. Yes, it's a step-by-step process. The bonus of the training is that we also give you some mental performance training in there so when things get tough, when you get knocked off course, you can get through that. You have the mental toughness, the ability to move forward under pressure. Remember, folks, your thoughts control your feelings and your feelings control your actions. That's the power of goal setting. It creates positive thoughts and in turn positive feelings which lead to positive actions. All components of success. Go on over to our website inspiringthem.com inspiringthem.com to get your copy of this fantastic course today or there is a link in the show notes below. Goal setting. Your life blueprint.